Ha ha! Okay, green ones. We have the last, last ever animal story to learn. It is, in my opinion, the funniest one. So let's jump in. This story is about a fish named Freddy. Okay, and Freddy, well, he doesn't like to follow the rules. The problem is he has three rules. Only three, but he has three rules. He never follows them. Here they are. Don't go swimming in the seaweed. Don't go swimming in the cave. And don't go swimming in the deepest, darkest part of the ocean. Well, after school, do you know what Freddy decided to do? Go swim in the seaweed. So he goes in the seaweed. He's swimming around. He's feeling pretty good. He's like, oh, yeah, feeling cool. Breaking the rules. Feeling pretty cool. But then it gets dark. Freddy gets lost. And Freddy gets scared. And he starts panicking and he's like, oh, where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? Shiny. He sees something shiny. He goes down. He looks at it. It's a marble. But he doesn't know what it is. So he eats it. Then he starts choking and he goes, ah, ah, all, all, ah. He spits it out and he goes, swims home as fast as he can. He says, Mom, Dad, Mom, Dad. <gasps> I was so scared. And I said, Freddy, what's wrong? What's wrong? He's like, well, I was swimming in the seaweed. I said, Freddy, you were swimming in the seaweed? You were not supposed to be swimming in the seaweed. Go to your room. So Freddy swam up the stairs and he said, it's not my fault I swallowed that awful ball. And I'm going to show you. The sounds are aww. Ah, like you're saying, ah, so cute, ah. And then we say all, all, like the sight word all. And then the last one we say awk, awk. Okay, like you're saying awkward, awk. So today after school, Freddy decides he's going to go swimming in the cave. Okay, so he goes to the cave. He's swimming around and he's like, oh yeah, pretty cool, breaking these rules. But then... It got dark. Freddy got lost. And Freddy got scared. And he's like, whoa, whoa, where do I go, where do I go? Shiny. Sees another shiny thing. He goes up to it. And guess what he does? He swallows it again and he chokes and he goes, ah, ah, all, all, ah. He spits it out, swims on his messes again. He says, mom, dad, mom, dad, I was so scared. And they said, Freddy, what was going on? They said, okay, well, I was swimming in the cave. And they said, Freddy, you were swimming in the cave? You were not supposed to be swimming in the cave. Go to your room. So Freddy swims up the stairs, and as he goes, he says, it's not my fault I swallowed that awful ball. The next day after school, Freddy swam to the deepest, darkest part of the ocean. He's swimming around. He's like, oh, yeah, feeling pretty cool, breaking the rules. But then it got dark. Freddy got lost, and Freddy got scared. So he starts getting scared. He's like, ah, ah, where do I go, where do I go, where do I go? Shiny. Sees a shiny thing. Swims up to it, and if you believe me, he eats it again. And he chokes on it, and he goes, now say it with me. Ah, ah, all, all, ah. And he spits it out. He swims home as fast as he can. He says, Mom, Dad, Mom, Dad, Mom, Dad. I was so scared. I said, Freddy, what's, what's going on? And he says, well, I was swimming in the deepest, darkest part of the ocean. I said, Freddy, you are not supposed to be swimming in the deepest, darkest part of the ocean. Go to your room. So he swims up the stairs and he says, it's not my fault I swallowed that awful ball. Now, fast forward a bunch of years. Freddy grows up. He gets married. Freddy has a little baby fish named Freddy Jr., Okay, so Freddy is at home cooking supper when Freddy Jr. comes bursting in the door and he says, Dad, 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 I was so scared. He says, Freddy Jr., what happened? And he said, well, I was swimming in the seaweed. And Freddy said, you have three rules, Freddy Jr. Don't swim in the seaweed. Don't go in the darkest part of the ocean. Don't go in the cave. Go to your room. And Freddy Jr. says, well, it's not my fault I swallowed that awful ball. And Freddy says, oh, no, history's repeating itself. And that is the end of the story of the fish that never follow the rules. 
Freddy is last for two reasons. One, my favorite story. Number two, it's confusing about all of the sounds that Freddy makes. So when you see A, U together, it's going to say ah, okay, like in fault, ah, okay. A, W says ah, like maybe in the word swallowed or like paw, like a cat's paw, they all say ah. Can you say ah? I sometimes think of it because it's like A, W. If you're at A and W and you have a burger and you go to open up your mouth, you say ah before you bite into it. So the first two say ah. Then when you see one A, L, it's going to say all, but also A, L, L will say all. Okay, like in the word fall. Um, and then awk, very last one. Doo -doo -doo. It, um, do, the L doesn't make a sound. We don't say alk, we say awk. Okay, and an example of this was a site where we just had walk. Okay, another word that rhymes with it is talk. So these are all the sounds that Freddie makes. Your job today is to go through your books and see if you can find any Freddy the Fish words. And if you find one, okay, have a little uh, recording book, okay? Maybe even in your green book if you don't have paper. So if you find a word, like if I find paw or ball, I'll record it. And then you can take a picture for me if you find any Freddy the Fish words at home, okay? And then when we get back to school, you can add it to the poster in our classroom. I hope you enjoyed that story. It's one of my favorites. Um, and it is our last um, vowel story. So thank you for listening. And go find Freddy the Fish words at your house.